Hello traders, so today's video is different, but it's about one minute trading. But the twist is we will only going to trade on Euro USD chart. One trader in our group suggested me that he is not understanding the concept of the videos because I keep switching the chart. He tried to analyze the chart, but till uh, till the time I switch the chart, he he gets confused more. So I thought I will make separate videos on separate chart. So this video is about Euro USD. So let's start trading. We will be trading on the one minute chart, and the first thing I will draw is my resistance level which is here as this is an intermediate level we will wait for the market to hit this level okay it's almost at the level so we will wait for a breakout or let's see okay here we have extreme level so we will draw these and another extreme level and you can see this level worked here okay it's gonna break the level but we have another level here and let's see we will wait for this candle if this it's on a break or not okay it's not a breakout and okay we will wait we will wait for this candle to close as the market reverses from a resistance level so i will not place a call here i will wait the market trend is downtrend completely let's wait for this candle to close and then we will analyze the chart accordingly and then we'll trade i will take two trades and we'll finish the video with the trade so let's see in how many how much time we will take the trade okay it gets the rejection from the support level and okay so now we can use this support level to place a trade i need a rejection and no okay we will wait for rejection okay this is a, okay this is a rejection let me show it in the five second you can see the green candle here two green candle form here i saw that rejection so i place the trade as the market this candle closes above the support level which was strong support level now the market will follow this support level that's why i place the trade as soon as the market goes down and we have the confirmation so now it's gonna be our first trade now we will wait for a breakout of this chart or this level because it's almost it's also very strong and if there is a breakout for this level we can trade for a call the trend i think is gonna finish here and will going to change to uptrend but let's wait what's in the mind of traders we have to trade accordingly okay let's see market is now moving in a downward direction we need to wait for a breakout here if the market breaks this particular support level or this resistance level we need to wait as the video is only about euro sd so we will stick with this chart only let's see and one more thing as uh, i will be going uh, on a wedding on the 27th of january uh, which is two days from now and so that i was not I, I will not be able to make videos for you all but i have uh, stored some videos in order to upload in order to 
make the videos continue so the stored video will be uploaded on the channel because i will be from 27th of january to the 8th of february so in this meantime i was i will not be able to make the video because i have to uh, keep myself free in the wedding so the videos that are stored by me from previously then i will upload those videos so that you all can understand and watch it so right now this is the video i'm making it on 25th of january i will upload it today if possible let's wait okay so as you can see if you look carefully if you look on the last candle what is the what is it suggesting it's suggesting that the market wants to go up so i will use a rejection and will place the trade okay if i didn't get the rejection i will not place a trade and i get the confirmation you can see i place the trade because the story the scandal suggesting market wants to go up here if you look carefully the market is not in any trend it's almost ranging and this support level was here which was previously strong support level and market reverses from this level it was weak and we took the trade let me show it in the five second chart you can see this is the confirmation we get so i think we have completed two trades on this chart which was our main aim and okay let i will take one more trade if possible okay so we have completed this trade as well so we have taken two trades and the video is not that long it's almost it's very small actually it's only seven minutes so i can take one more trade so i will wait five more minutes if we get the opportunity otherwise i will leave the video so let's start discussing the story okay so if you if you look carefully this candle why i took this trade because market started to go down but if you look carefully uh, the last half hour of chart is ranging market so there are no trend at all if you look carefully here this was this was a strong support level which was extreme support level and the market came down very strongly to this level but it reverses the market was very strongly coming down the, the sellers are very strong but still the market moves up it shows the strength of this level it shows the uh, strongness of this level and that's why i decided to place a trade because this candle gives me a hope that market now will reverse and so instead of placing a call here i waited for the market to go down hitting the support level of this level and as soon as we have the rejection i place the trade as you can see the level was not broken on this candle as well so the market again goes up so this is how you can analyze the chart the can this candle gives me a hope that the market now will reverse and will not break this level the last candle was very strong but instead of breaking this level the market reverses that's why this level is very strong and i place the trade accordingly so we will wait now as you can see market is going up it reverses from that support level you can see it's it's totally ranging now so we will wait for a breakout from this level if if there is a breakout here i can hope to get a good entry point taking a trade on this level will be risky so i will remove these tray these levels so now we have two levels one is here and another one is here okay let me include the wick as well okay right now market is moving in between we will not trade in between the chart we need to use strong support or resistance level in order to trade okay let me see if we can have a trade opportunity i can this was a support level yes it was a support level but okay it was a support level so the main problem when you are trading in between the chart is because you can't understand you can't predict where the market will go in the future because if you have a support you can predict that the chances of market going up will be high but if there is no support level how can you predict if the market will go up or down so you have to be using support and resistance level in order to trade 
okay if there if if the candle breaks the level then i will trade otherwise not because it will again reverse so if this is a breakout then we can trade we need to wait okay i want this candle to break this level so that i can take one more trade let's wait and it's gonna finish in next 10 second let me include this level as well okay so as you can see it's a breakout so now we are here we can trade here and i will take a trade if we have the rejection from the support level okay yes we can take a trade we need a rejection a proper rejection a sufficient rejection is necessary so we will wait okay let me check in five second chart you can see there are no strong candlestick in five second chart not a proper rejection which we can use to trade okay we will wait for this candle we have to match our story with the we have to with the support or resistance with because if you analyze the chart this candle is a breakout candle suggesting market will go up so we can expect that the market will go up so instead of placing a call here you need to wait for the market to go down if and if you have a rejection from the level of support you can place a trade but right now market is going up okay it's going up let me remove all this level first I will draw fresh levels this is the limit this is the whole area of resistance you can see and okay market reverses from that resistance level okay let's get good rejection okay 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 we will wait the market was strong that's why i didn't take the trade but okay the chances of the market the chances of this candle to be green are more and it, it's almost 70 percent that this candle will close as green but it's risky because the last candle is strong but still still i am 70 percent sure that this candle will going to be a green candle and why is that because the market reverses but it closed just at just at the last green candle and it, it, it's kind of supporting the market that's why i was sure that this candle was going to be a green candle but you, you don't have to take trades on these condition it's just for prediction not for taking trades okay okay it's, it again goes up okay and my prediction seems correct it closes as a green because of the tiny support level here okay so now okay video is 15 minute almost so i will again repeat this this may be my last video for you all and from now onwards you all will get 
the videos that are stored for the purpose of wedding so if you find any difference in the chart because uh, in the chart uh, from yours then it, it's because I have recorded the videos previously I'm not recording the video I will not be recording the video in the coming 10 days so don't get confused okay I need to take a trade it's almost our prediction as well because of the breakout breakout is very important. Breakouts with